Hi guys, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to fix your computer's keyboard if it's not working in Windows 10. So I'm going to show you, you know, four methods over here and you can try that out to fix your computer's keyboard. Okay, so before trying these methods, uh, we have to enable the on-screen keyboard because our physical keyboard is not working. Okay, so in order to do that, you have to, you know, right click on this Windows Start button and then click on this settings and then click on ease of access and you have to scroll down and then click on keyboard and here we have this use the on screen keyboard uh, just click on that in order to enable it okay so here we have this on screen keyboard and let's go to our methods so method one we have to turn off filter keys if they are turned on okay so in order to do that you have we have to go to the control panel okay so here is our on-screen keyboard and you have to click on this search box over here and type the control panel space p a n e l Okay, and then minimize this. As you can see guys, here we have this control panel. Click on that. And guys, if you have this, you know, large icons or, you know, small icons selected, you have to click on this and click on this category. And then click on this ease of access. And here you need to click on this change how your keyboard works. And under make it easier to type, here we have this turn on filter keys. Okay. So make sure guys, uh, it is, you know, unchecked, okay? You have to turn off the filter keys. And you have to click on this apply, and then okay. Ease of access center. Close this window. And guys, after that, you need to, you know, restart your computer. And let's see if this, you know, method works out for you or not, okay? So you tried this, you know, method one, and it's not working for you okay your computer's keyboard is not working so you can try this method too so method two we have is uh, you have to update drivers of your keyboard okay so in order to do that we have to go to this you know device manager okay so uh, we have to bring the you know run window so you have to go to this windows start button and right click on that and then click on run okay and bring back your this on screen keyboard and in this box over here let me type it again for you dev mgmt dot msc let's minimize this and you have to click on this OK button. As you can see, this brings this, you know, device manager window. Let's go to full screen. Okay. So, and after that, you need to expand this keyboards. I have a standard PS slash two keyboard. Just select your keyboard and right click and then click on update driver so how do you want to search for drivers so we have two options search automatically for updated driver software and browse my computer for driver software so we're gonna select this one okay this time so windows will search your computer and internet for the latest driver software for your device okay so just click on that i'm also connected to the internet so as you can see it is searching online for drivers as you can see guys the best drivers for your device are already installed okay so i have you know the drivers already installed for my keyboard yours might be not okay guys and after that you need to click on this close button and you need to restart your computer and uh, you can check whether your keyboard is working or not okay so i'm not gonna do that because i'm gonna show you the other methods okay so let me click on no 
you have to click on yes okay okay guys so you tried this uh, you know method and it's not working for you then again you need to come to this device manager and expand this keyboards and just like the standard ps slash 2 keyboard or your keyboard and right click on that and click on update driver and this time we have to click on this browse my computer for driver software locate and install driver software manually okay so just click on that and click on this let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer click on that and just select the driver and then click on next as you can see guys it's installing and I have already installed so it's showing me the message Windows has successfully updated your drivers okay and guys after that you need to click on close and you need to restart your computer okay and you can check whether your you know keyboard is working or not okay I'm not gonna do that because I'm gonna show you the other methods okay so let me close this window and let's go to our methods okay okay guys so you tried this method too and you know it's not working for you okay so you can try this method three you have to uninstall the keyboard driver and install it again okay so again you need to go to the go to the you know device manager okay so let me go that okay and you have to click on this Windows start button and click on this run and again you need to type this devmgmt.msc using your this on screen keyboard and then click on OK and let me go to full screen and after that guys you need to expand this keyboards and just select your keyboard and right click on that and click on this un uninstall device okay uh, I'm not doing that but you have to uninstall the device okay and if your keyboard is not working so after you are done uninstalling this you know this driver uh, you have to click on this action and you have to click on this scan for hardware changes okay so it will automatically you know detect the drivers for your keyboard and install it okay guys and after that you you need to you know restart your computer and check whether your computer whether your keyboard is working or not okay so let me close that okay guys so you tried this you know method 3 and it's not working for you then you can try this method you know 4 you might have fast startup you know enabled in power options so we need to you know disable it as you can see method 4 disable fast startup in power options so in order to do that uh, we have to go to the control panel okay so let me go that okay so uh, click on this you know search box over here and uh, bring your on screen you know keyboard and type control panel okay sorry let me click that and type control panel panel let me minimize this okay guys so here we have this control panel just click on that and guys if you have this you know category selected just click on that click on large icons and then click on power options and click on this choose what the power button does and click on this change settings that are currently unavailable and guys here uh, you have this turn on fast startup okay so it is recommended settings but your keyboard is not working so you can try this method by you know unchecking this okay so you just need to uncheck this and then click on this save changes and just close this and you need to restart your computer to check whether your com uh, whether your keyboard is working or not okay guys so you can try all these methods and let me know in the comment section whether it it uh, you know they are working for you or not okay so if you like my videos please please support me by subscribing to my channel that's it guys thanks for watching bye bye